It is a soggy night. It is a foggy night, and it is going to end up becoming a weekend where we go from rain over to snow. So lots going to be happening in the next 24 hours. We have the rain right now pretty widespread across the area. A couple little spots up in Mercer County where it's heavier, but this rain continues to move on and continues to stream in here. But it is starting to break up a little bit, so there will be more scattered showers. But in between the actual rain, there's a little drizzle that the radar has a hard time picking up and some fog in between. And through the weekend, we're actually going to see a couple things happening. We start off early tomorrow morning still with our temperatures hanging on to these 40s, but those temps fall through the course of the day, and that's going to transition our rain over to snow. Come Sunday, you're looking at temperatures in the upper 30s with some late snow developing. And keep in mind, this is still warmer than average. A typical temperature this time of year is 36 degrees. Fog settled into Pittsburgh here. We're looking from the top of Gateway Center down towards the Fort Duquesne Bridge, and you can see that fog has dropped into town. 49 degrees is the current temperature. And visibility at the airport is one mile, less than that here in town. And know that through the course of the night, we are going to see this fog in spots, especially down into the river valleys. When you have a warm, uh, a warm front lift across the area, when the ground's still kind of cold, you get this fog set up. The water's cold in the river valleys. That helps with the fog. And we have 50 degrees in Washington, 49 in Pittsburgh. So this mild weather is actually working against us tonight in helping that fog out. And there's rain showers in between. Next several days, temperatures do fall off a bit. We get closer to average, but we stay mainly above that average of 36 through much of the forecast. Wednesday, the only exception to that. Now, the big picture shows this rain continues to stream in here, but there is some colder air just back to our west. There's an area low pressure here that is uh, sending some uh, snow showers our way. So getting into early tomorrow morning, we're still going to be dealing with some scattered rain showers around. The next low comes in right behind it. So this disturbance is going to kick up some rain showers initially, but as temperatures continue to fall, we're going to transition that over to snow. Not really anything accumulation wise other than a coating. You could get one to two inches up in the ridges. We catch a little break early Sunday. Then Sunday, as we get later into it, the next disturbance zips in here, dropping a little more snow. And again, not much to write home about in the way of accumulations. 43 degrees tonight. Rain, areas of fog into tomorrow. We see the rain change over to snow. Temperatures mid 40s early, falling to the lower 30s by the time we end the day. 39 degrees for your high temperature comes Sunday, and that comes with that late snow. That'll be out of here by the time we get up Monday, 41 degrees there. And that's uh, one of the drier days of the week. Come Tuesday, snow showers around. Wednesday, too, then partly cloudy skies as we head into Thursday. And if you like the warmer weather, it comes right back. This time next week, 49 degrees with another round of rain. And I know a lot of people have big plans for the weekend. Make sure you keep ahead of the weather with the KDK weather app. It has an interactive radar. It'll show you where the rain and the snow are. It gives you the current conditions, hour by hour forecast, daily forecast, and more. Just search CBS Pittsburgh in the App Store and in Google Play.